Hey everybody out there, this is your boy Wade Duel once again to talk to you about the daily bullshit in the gaming industry. Uh, what I'm talking about next is what's going on at the EA Star Wars Battlefront forums. That will be starwars.ea.com slash starwars slash battlefront slash forums. Uh, go there and you can provide feedback. Now here I'm going to provide, uh, hopefully I can provide a, a link to this in the, in the description. Um, it's a... Uh, Oh fuck! I can't. Shit. I I uh, screen capped it. It's a a PNG uh, file. But I'll just read it to you. Uh, basically, what it is. So somebody made a uh, a uh, thread uh, call on the forums called "Not Star Wars Battlefront." It's Star Wars Battlefield. And there's a ton of people, like a mass amount of people, that have been on that forums since that beta launched, and they've been raging and pissed off. And basically what fucking EA is doing over there at the forums is they're silencing all dissent, all criticism. You are not allowed to criticize. You're only allowed to provide positive, positive, or what they call constructive, <coughs> excuse me, constructive feedback. But it has to be framed in a very positive, you know, worshipping, you know, we love you EA sort of fashion. You, you cannot criticize this game or be upset at this game at all or they will close your thread and potentially ban you. So this is what a mod said to this guy who made this. And he didn't swear at them. He didn't say nothing like, you know, that you would maybe potentially remove a thread for. Like comp swearing at them, saying you want everybody to die, even like I did in my one video. They uh, they were very, you know, say, hey, I don't like this. This doesn't feel like Battlefront. This feels like Star Wars uh, Battlefield. Uh, and went on and on. And he said... Uh, uh, his name is The Pool Shark, all lowercase, and he's a moderator there. He says, feedback, not just straight up criticism. You can po post what you would like to see in the game, but just saying it is terrible because it isn't the same as the old game is not feedback. So you are not allowed to voice your concerns about the game. You are not allowed to criticize the game in any way. You can only post positive feedback. Now, I personally, myself, have had many of my threads removed. And I know I can be quite pissed off, and I can swear, and that's just who I am. I tell it like it is. I don't sugarcoat, sugarcoat nothing. I tell it straight up as it is and how I feel from my heart. And uh, I made sure. I made several posts there, and I made sure to keep it toned down. I made sure to, you know, tamper things down so I don't get my threads locked or removed. And I've had every single one of my threads there removed. Every one. And every one who posts anything negative against this game now is now being silenced and removed from the forums. So I thought I'd just let you guys know what's going on there. Fuck EA and fuck DICE. Fuck this $50 season pass bullshit, which will cost you a lot more than $50 to buy the DLC separately. This game is launching with next to no content whatsoever, and it's had a ton of content that was probably going to be in the main game, cut out from the game, only to be sold back as DLC. I really will never shut up. And here's something else. There's a guy named Dave, I don't know how to pronounce his name, Shrovelling. I apologize if I mispronounce your name, Dave. But he recently made a video. I do like a lot of his content, and I have been on his podcast, but he said something that really pissed me off. Uh, he said something like, oh, you know, fuck you and shut the fuck up. Don't complain about uh, EA's Battlefront season pass because you won't buy it. Uh, I will never shut up, and I will never stop speaking out against bullshit and shitty practices, and I shouldn't have to buy into a shitty practice to be able to complain about it. I have every right, as a gamer, somebody who's 28 years old and who's lived through, you know, some of the earlier times of gaming and seen a lot of bullshit, and I've seen gaming evolve and change as time goes on, and I've seen a lot of things come and go. And I have every right to bitch and complain. This is a horrible thing that EA is doing. This is not Battlefront. This is Star Wars Battlefield. And that's something I predicted, you know, a long time ago. And my fears were brought to light. Fuck this game, man. Seriously, everybody, speak out about it. Spam them on those forums. Keep going there. Screen cap. Find proof. Make videos like this. Call EA, EA out wherever you can. Call them up complain to them, bitch to them, let them know, because honestly, just not buying it is not enough, because there's too many corporate whore dick riders, too many corporate whore worshippers out there that will buy whatever the fuck these companies fart out their ass, regardless of the quality, no matter what.
and there's so many of them that the, the companies are still going to make a profit. So what's the next step? What can we do other than just not buying it? We need to aggressively speak out in every forum, every website, everywhere that you can. If you can call them, great. If you can email them, that's great too. Guys, we need to fight, fight against this bullshit. I can't believe this, man. They're silencing dissent. But they're not going to silence me on my channel. I'm never going to shut up. I'm going to keep bitching about this as much as I can until something is done. And when nothing is done and, you know, the game turns out to be a fucking piece of shit and launches with no content and there's a lot more people that are pissed off and angry, I can say, look, man, I told you so. Maybe you should have, uh, maybe you should have listened to me. Maybe you should have, uh, you know, spoke, spoke out against these bullshit practices. You know, gaming is going to become just like the mobile market completely. So that means console games, PC games, handheld gaming games, you know, everything is going to be like you're going to be getting half-baked games with hardly any content for a full premium purchase price with fucking a shit ton of expensive DLC tacked onto it. And this is not the way to go, and gaming fucking sucks if this is the future, and I don't like this future, and I'm going to fight with every fiber of my being against it, because I love gaming, or used to really love gaming. Gaming has always been a big part of my life, and I see it dying, and I feel it's something worth fighting for, and I'm going to fight for it till the very end. So, yeah, EA silencing dissent on their forums to provide feedback. I provided some good feedback, what they need to do. They need to delay the game. They need to change a lot of things, and, and they cut that out. They, they, they ban me. I can't, I can't do nothing there anymore. So, anyways, yeah, I just figured I'd let you guys out. And, Dave, if you see this video, man, hey, uh, you can make a response if you want. Uh, I left a couple of messages on this channel. He's kind of, I was pretty pissed off, but I don't know. I'm I'm going off on a range of changes. Just bad news all around in the gaming industry. It seems there's hardly anything good anymore. And honestly, I look forward to a crash. So everybody, I'm gonna end this video now. Please speak out wherever you can, everywhere, and often.